But here's what people would say from the uh, opposing side. They would say, like, look, you, you escaped Saudi Arabia because of the, val uh, the values and the religious uh, extremism that they had there. Shouldn't we be careful not to let too many people here that will bring the same things that you were running away from uh, to, to a country like Canada? For example, uh, one example that just happened uh, a, a week or two or so ago was this woman, a Yazidi woman. She actually met uh, her uh, ISIS sl uh, slave owner, like the person that owned her, in Germany. And she reported her, but she, nothing could be done to him because he was also a refugee. And she ran away back to uh, Kurdistan, I think it was, I think where she was from, I'm not sure. But uh, to, because she was too afraid to stay in Germany. <coughs> Basically, the yeah. argument is like, why would we let in more of what you ran away from? Mm -hmm. Right. So that's the argument. Um, I saw that story because of that. Um, I urge. Um, uh, uh, l l l l l refugee board in Canada and um, Germany to to look look uh, for to make a search uh, to know the history of every refugee uh, uh, get in their uh, country uh, because uh, that. Maybe ISIS member can become a refugee there. Uh, there, that it's uh, on fire, really. Yeah. Secular Jihadists is an increasingly influential podcast with much of its growing audience in Muslim majority countries, advocating for atheists, secularists, and Enlightenment thinkers. We want to reach out to more people. If we reach 500 patrons, we will be able to translate our shows into Arabic, Urdu, Persian, Bengali, Malay, Turkish and other languages in these countries. Help us get there at patreon.com slash sjme.